What is Node.js? Node.js is a JavaScript runtime built on Chrome's V8 JavaScript engine, allowing for server-side scripting and the creation of scalable network applications. How does Node.js handle asynchronous operations? Node.js uses an event-driven, non-blocking I.O. model via an event loop to handle asynchronous operations efficiently. What is the event loop in Node.js? The event loop is a core feature in Node.js that handles asynchronous callbacks, allowing for non-blocking I.O. operations. What are the main components of the Node? JS event loop. The main components are timers, IO callbacks, idle and prepare, hole, check, close callbacks, and the event queue. How do you handle exceptions in Node.js? Exceptions in Node.js can be handled using try catch blocks or synchronous code and callback functions or promises with dot catch for asynchronous code. What is a callback function in Node.js? A callback function is a function passed as an argument to another function, which is executed after the completion of a specific task. What is middleware in Node.js? Middleware functions are functions that have access to the request and response objects and can modify or end the request response cycle in an express application. How do you create a simple server in Node.js? You can create a simple server using the HTTP module by calling HTTP.createServer and specifying a request handler function. What is NPM? NPM, Node Package Manager, is the default package manager for Node.js, used to install, share, and manage dependencies in Node.js projects. How do you install a package using NPM? You can install a package using the command npm install package name. What is packaged JSON? Packaged JSON is a file in a node JS project that contains metadata about the project and lists its dependencies and scripts. How do you create a packaged JSON file? You can create a package JSON file using the command npm init and following the prompts, or npm init, y for default values. What is Expressed.js? Expressed.js is a minimal and flexible node, JS web application framework that provides robust features for web and mobile applications. How do you handle routing in Expressed.js? Routing in Expressed JS is handled by defining routes using methods like app-get, app-post, app-put, app-delete, etc., with specified paths and handler functions. What is the difference between require and import? Require is used in common JS modules and import is used in ES6 modules. Note, JS traditionally uses require, but supports ES6 modules with .mjs files or enabling a specific configuration. How do you manage environment variables in Node.js? Environment variables can be managed using the process env object or by using packages like dotenv to load variables from a.env file. What is the purpose of the moduled exports in Node.js? Moduled exports is used to export functions, objects, or primitives from a module so they can be required and used in other modules. What are streams in Node.js? Streams are objects that allow reading or writing of data in a continuous flow, commonly used for handling large files or data chunks. What are the types of streams in Node.js? The types of streams are readable, writable, duplex, both readable and writable, and transform, a type of duplex stream. How do you read a file in Node.js? You can read a file using the fs module's fs to read file method for asynchronous reading or fs read file sync for synchronous reading. How do you write a file in Node.js? You can write a file using the fs module's fs to write file method for asynchronous writing or fs to write file sync. 
for synchronous writing. What is the purpose of the buffer module in Node.js? The buffer module provides a way to handle binary data directly, useful for file I.O., networking, and other operations requiring raw binary data. How do you make an HTTP request in Node.js? You can make an HTTP request using the HTTP or HTTPS modules, or by using third-party libraries like Axios or Request. What is a promise in Node.js? A promise is an object representing the eventual completion or failure of an asynchronous operation, providing then and catch methods for handling results and errors. How do you create a promise in Node.js? You can create a promise by instantiating a new promise object and passing in a function that takes resolve and reject as arguments. What are async slash await in Node.js? Async slash await are syntactic features in JavaScript that allow writing asynchronous code in a synchronous manner, using async to define a function and await to pause execution until a promise resolves. What is a RESTful API? A RESTful API is an architectural style for designing networked applications using HTTP methods and URL endpoints to create, read, update, and delete resources. How do you handle JSON data in Node.js? JSON data can be handled using JSON.parse to convert JSON strings into JavaScript objects and JSON.stringify to convert objects into JSON strings. What is middleware in express.js? Middleware in express.js is a function that has access to the request and response objects and can modify or end the request response cycle or pass control to the next middleware function. How do you connect to a database in node.js? You can connect to a database in node.js using various libraries such as Mongoose for MongoDB, PG for PostgreSQL, and MySQL for MySQL. What is the purpose of process? Next tick in Node.js. Process? Next tick. Schedules a callback function to be invoked in the next iteration of the event loop before any I.O. operations. How do you handle file uploads in Node.js? File uploads can be handled using middleware like Multer in an expressed JS application, allowing you to handle multi-part slash form data input. What is clustering in Node.js? Clustering in Node.js involves creating multiple instances of the Node.js process to handle concurrent connections, utilizing multi-core system capabilities. What are WebSockets? WebSockets are a protocol for full duplex communication channels over a single TCP connection, enabling real-time data exchange between client and server. How do you implement WebSockets in Node.js? WebSockets can be implemented using the WS library in Node.js, allowing you to create and manage WebSocket connections. What is the purpose of the path module in Node.js? The path module provides utilities for working with file and directory paths, such as resolving, normalizing, joining, and parsing paths. How do you create a secure server in Node.js? You can create a secure server using the HTTPS module along with SSL slash TLS certificates for encrypted communication. What is the OS module used for in Node.js? The OS module provides operating system-related utility methods and properties, such as getting system information and network interfaces. How do you handle errors in Express.js? Errors in Express.js can be handled using error handling middleware defined by functions with four arguments, error, req, res, next. What is the purpose of the crypto module in Node.js? The crypto module provides cryptographic functionality, including hashing, encryption, and decryption. 
How do you schedule tasks in Node.js? Tasks in Node.js can be scheduled using the set timeout, set interval, or libraries like Node Schedule for more complex scheduling. What is the difference between read file and create read stream? Read file reads the entire file into memory before returning it, while create read stream reads the file in chunks, which is more efficient for large files. How do you share code between files in Node.js? Code can be shared between files in Node.js using the module exports object to export functions, objects, or variables from one file and require to import them into another file. What is the purpose of the util module in Node.js? The util module provides utility functions for various common tasks, such as formatting strings, inheriting prototypes, and permissifying callback-based functions. How do you create an HTTPS server in Node.js? You can create an HTTPS server using the HTTPS module and providing the SSL slash TLS certificates, then calling HTTPS.createServer with the options and request handler. What is the role of the DNS module in Node.js? The DNS module provides functions to perform DNS queries and to resolve domain names into IP addresses and vice versa. How do you debug a Node.js application? You can debug a Node.js application using the built-in debugger statement, the node inspect command, or IDEs with integrated debugging tools like Visual Studio Code. What is the cluster module in Node.js? The cluster module allows you to create child processes, workers, that share the same server port, enabling load balancing across multiple CPU cores. How do you handle static files in an Expressed.js application? Static files can be handled using the Expressed static middleware serving files from a specified directory. What is the purpose of the child underscore process module in Node.js? The child underscore process module is used to spawn child processes, allowing you to execute commands and scripts in separate processes and communicate with them.